I'm Kevin Holmes with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines. Two people are hurt after lightning strikes a home in Kansas City Thursday. Officials say one person was hit, the other hurt while working on the roof. The lightning strike also caused a small fire. The mother of two girls found dead in Clay County now charged in a separate case. Jenna Bodecker facing domestic assault charges after an alleged fight with the girl's father. Prosecutors say it happened July 3rd, one day before the girl's deaths. Investigators have not released how the children died. Plus, a 4th of July foul in Overland Park. Police say someone set off fireworks at Sapling Grove Park. They caused extensive damage to a shelter and the park's bathroom, totaling more than $20,000 in damage. Witnesses say they saw a group of teens running from the area. If you know anything, you're asked to call police. With a check of your forecast, here's Chief Meteorologist Gary Lezak. Good news, Kevin. Drier air will be moving in 70 degrees by morning, slightly cooler, drier, lower humidity, and still up to 89 degrees tomorrow. But again, it'll feel pretty good for July, no doubt about it. Seven day forecast. I do expect heat to build back in in a few days, but look, there's no chance of rain showing up now for the next seven days, maybe. And I hope that will change because it is starting to really dry out. In July, we average about four inches of rain. Now get your forecast and news at KSHB.com anytime. Have a good night.